In today's video, I'm going to be discussing about a product. Hey, 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 what's going on, guys? My name is Vanessa Even Suarez, and you're welcome back to my channel if this is the first time that you're dropping by or maybe stopping by do all to hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so that you get to see videos like this anytime i post them so this is a requested video someone said or someone asked that i talked about this particular product and hold on let me get the product the name of this product is the ct plus that's the claire therapy yeah can you see this? Yeah. So that's like the product. This is how it looks like. And uh, it's in a, I don't know. I think there is a variant for this. I think it comes in um, different grades. I think it comes in different variants per se. It has, uh, this is the carrot. Yeah. So I just actually bought this for the sake of this video. This is how it looks like. Okay, it comes in a very, wow. Ah, sodium metabisulfide does that to me all the time, man. So without saying much, this product either contains a, a, a skin lightening agent that e easily oxidizes. Now this is because it has a powerful antioxidant in it, which is sodium metabisulfite. And anytime you have sulfites in your products, they tend to come out with this smell, especially if that product is ranging or raving around, you know, an acidic environment or an acidic pH. All right, so um, let's talk about this. So CT plus, the full meaning of CT symbolizes clear therapy and um, Though there are some words here in French, I really don't know French, but it's telling you that this particular lotion would lighten your skin or brighten your skin because there's a picture of a woman right here and they did like a before split up, a trim on her skin, a part of her face is a little bit dark and the other part is quite light. And I think they are saying in 10 days, you can see this, it says in 10 days your skin will be brighter than what you have. So it says extra lightning lotion, flawless complexion. But these are the claims of this product. It also claims to have um, carrot oil in it, which I really feel like it's a it's overhyped. Like seriously, carrot oil will not whiten your skin. I don't know why people really talk about carrot oil. And it says antitaches. I that's that's like in French. That's without spot, I guess and it says reduces okay yeah 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 spots so reduces pigmentation minimizes dark spots so that's like the claims of this product and i i'm going to confirm this with the ingredient list what exactly is the ingredient list talking about what is the ingredient list saying that this product will do and then we see that yes it is really doing the job so um let's read the back it says ct plus is a milk formula specially developed for pigmentation problems this authentic skin lightening therapy is a fruit acid complex targeting pigmentation spots formed due to the sun damage age and pregnancy now the unifying action of the highly concentrated there's some words and there's some there's some act there's some keywords that you need to stress especially when buying a product like this you know when you buy a product like this and then the company or the label always read the thing read what it's there on the label that's why it's there so if they say it is extra concentrated then that simply means that this particular product is meant or has to be used in some type of way special type of way okay not just apply it on your skin and then you get out of the house and you move around no it is freaking concentrated guys that means you need to be careful with using it okay so i'm going to continue ct plus gives you a flawless complexion used daily the results are visible after just 10 days your skin is fresh and smoother now apply twice a day after bath or shower now 
we are going to know, we're going to actually confirm if we can wear this every single day. So the ingredients um, list is aquab, that's water, petroleum jelly, liquid petrolatum, um, stearic acid, glycerin, fruit acid, AHA, um, kojic acid, allantoin, silicon oil, BHT, laurel C16, laurel C18, carrot oil, perfume, that's fragrance, hydroquinone, max 2%. And now these guys were just mentioning words here. They did not say sodium metal bisulfite. So I really would not trust this product because everything written here in the ingredient list may not be what is inside here and then i will not just trust the two percent that they said it is now somebody else said that she has used this product and then it gave her green veins and stretch marks now it's a very good lotion not like it's bad it's okay but now look at the warning signs they said here on the label it says it contains hydroquinone rinse thoroughly after each application in case of contact with eyes, rinse immediately. Do not use to dye lashes or eyebrows. Keep out of reach of children and do not expose yourself to the sun. So it says everything here, guys. It has said every single thing. Exactly. So it has actually warned you not to use this product just like that and leave on your skin. So this simply means that this product is a rinse off product. It's not supposed to stay on your skin for a very long time. Yeah, that's what it's saying. So when you use this product, you lay it on your skin, you wait for about five minutes or you wait for about 10 minutes, you're to rinse it off. That simply means that this product is suitable after you clean your skin or maybe when you have your bath in the morning or you could just use water to like rinse your skin, pat your skin, like make sure it is a little bit damp and then you apply this and go back to the bathroom and neutralize it. So hydroquinone is a powerful ingredient okay it will really really help with hyperpigmentations this we know but if you're not careful it will leave your skin with um you know the pigmentations will come back in double so you don't want that to happen to you and as they have said in this product on the label they have told you do not use this product and then leave it on your skin it says rinse thoroughly after each application so when you're applying it on your dark marks your bikini areas where you have those dark um areas you know on your skin maybe your elbows your knuckles your knees your bikini lines you know your feet you need to rinse this off after each application and the only way this would work for you is when you rinse it off maybe when you keep it on your skin for about five to ten to ten minutes and um you rinse it off maybe later on or if you know you want it to really really do the job you can leave it on for about 20 minutes all right 20 minutes it will just be there now this product contains um petroleum jelly now this is an emollient it is not meant to penetrate inside your skin it is meant to moisturize your skin whereby protecting you know the barriers of the skin so it stays like a film on your skin it doesn't go in it stays right on top it sits on your skin all right to keep it moisturized to make sure that water is not escaping or we call it transepidermal water loss so we I think that's a nice thing here and, and it also has glycerin which is also good a powerful humectant that would really help the skin to um, get moisture okay then it also has fruit acids AHA now the thing with fruit acids is that fruit acids would work a uh, uh, skin lightener rather so a skin lightening agent here and acids will go well together like I said it's all about the pH so wherever there, is, there are fruit acids, you need to use every other type of skin lightening or whitening agent that would roll or revolve around the acids. So say for example, hydroquinone, kojic acid, and this product contains both of them like it claims to have. You need to make sure you're not adding niacinamide in this formula because if you're using niacinamide right here, it may not be bioavailable, not necessarily irritate your skin. But now that it has fruit acid complex, this simply means this product is likely to irritate your skin because it should be working below the normal pH level of the skin. So kojic acid works best at a pH of about 3.5 and hydroquinone works 
they're about that same pH grade. So if you if you want to formulate a product, you should be formulating the product with hydroquinone and kojic acid, but in an acidic environment or an acidic pH. I don't know if that is too advanced. I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> That's just it. So where to summarize it, this is what it is. So this product definitely has it. It has hydroquinone, it has fruit acids, which makes sense in conjunction with um, hydroquinone and kojic acid. I don't know if you understand. So that is it for it, guys. The best way to use this, make sure you're using it on your dark areas. If you're using it all over your body, then that's still fine. Make sure you take your bath afterwards. Now, the water is there to neutralize the concentrated effect of this, of this lotion. And once you're done using that, you should go ahead and apply like a normal moisturizer, your Cetaphil, your Cerave, or you can just formulate something, a very basic lotion per se, and follow up with a sunscreen with about SPF 50 max. All right, just don't um, go out like that in the sun. So that's it for this, guys. I hope I helped out today with the little I can, and I hope to see you all again. If you want me to do something like this again, for products like this please do let me know hit it uh write it down in the comment section okay i can't wait to be with you guys again okay? and um see you all again like do not forget yeah do not forget to subscribe and also hit the notification bell please thank you bye